friends welcome in this video we would learn the basic statistical functions those are inbuilt in r studio and can be used very easily first import your file this is my file it contains gdb per capita internet and their log transformed variables from the period 1998 to 2014 this is per annum data now i want to compute some statistical values for them so first we'll start from the mean suppose you want to compute mean for the variable gdp per capita so what will do use you will use the command x dollar gdp per capita just to access that column and you will use the command mean for that purpose you would use the command mean to compute mean okay friends so now we click on this command and run you can also access the command by its column number the column number here is first and second it's second column so what you can do x square brackets this is the way we extract from a data frame the column two means it's second column and click on run we can see the same output okay friends after that we go to median the formula is median and the variable now we go to minimum value min is a function for that now we go for the maximum value max is a function for that if we want to compute the range like minimum and maximum value for that variable gdp per capita so we would use a command range for that so 1398 is the minimum value 2050 is the maximum value here we can also compute the standard deviation using the command sd click okay is the standard deviation which shows the volatility now we go to the variance by using the command var variance if you want to compute the covariance of two variables suppose we want to compute the covariance of gdp per capita and internet we can use the command cov cov and mention the two variables if you want to compute the correlation the command is cor cor if you want to compute the quantiles you can use the command quantile if you want to find the quantiles you can use the quantile the variable name and which quantile just mention that like 0.25 means uh, uh, it's 25th quantile or we can say it's first quartile similarly 0.75 is the third quartile or 75th quantile okay friends so we can compute any quantile as 25th it's 75th quantile okay friends uh, there is one more option here by using summary command for a variable you can get six values like minimum first quartile medium mean third quartile and maximum value so it's very easy so these are the basic commands there are other commands but i wanted to mention uh, this much only because it will save your time you can explore further for other additional commands okay friends keep watching